concerning for parents this weekend as new episodes of a controversial Netflix show are released. Healthcare experts tell our Adam Weiner that the show called 13 Reasons Why shines a light on trouble some teens are having right here in the Tampa Bay area. Thank you for calling 211. This is Monique speaking. How can I help you? The crisis center of Tampa Bay is ready for a spike in calls this weekend as Netflix releases new episodes of their show called 13 Reasons Why. At last time around, we saw our suicide call rate go from 10 calls a day to nearly 28 calls a day. The nonprofit CEO, Clara Reynolds, says parents need to talk about suicide with their teen kids, even if you don't think they're watching the show about a teen girl who takes her own life. And I asked him, I said, Corey, have you ever heard of this? He goes, Mom, I've already watched it. He we watched it on his cell phone during the hour long bus rides. This week, a South Florida mom is warning other parents she didn't see any warning signs ahead of her own daughter's suicide attempt. Maybe some kids have signs, not my child. Katrina made marks on her own arms to show the size of the scars her daughter is now healing from. Her daughter says she made a suicide pact with classmates. I'm mad because it was a pact between five kids. Um, any of the mother four could have stood up and said something. The Tampa Bay area saw a spike in teen suicides last year, says Reynolds, who hopes parents will encourage their kids not to be bystanders. Helping them understand what diseases of the brain are and how they can help each other. We have a link to resources on abcactionnews.com. I'm Adam Weiner for The Now Tampa Bay.